welcome to a special presentation of the NBA on Christmas Day here on 2K Sports. We want to wish each and every one of you a Merry Christmas. With our Santas, Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr and Doris Burke, this is Kevin Hart. Look now, State Farm presents the starting lineups. Someone will be keeping an eye on Ronnie Brewer. You know, usually you hear about a guy who likes to mix it up and fight for every loose ball, and it's an undersized forward. That's why coaches love Ronnie Brewer. He's a big guard out on the wing who still gives 100% every time there is in terms of gaining possessions. He really does just create extra chances with his defense. If he gets down into traffic and a drive, I think there's always a good chance he'll be able to knock the ball loose, get you in a fast break, and go on the other way. And the Knicks looking for a positive start here on their road trip. Going up against a capable opponent, but you see their confidence. This one they feel they should win. They'll look to come out strong and show they're the better team. Well, you know, they've only played these guys once during the regular season, but they did beat them. So they've got to feel pretty good about their chances. The matchup seems to be pretty good for them. And Steve, if they win this one, that'll technically make it a 2-0 sweep. Not a major accomplishment, but still something you could feel good about. World Peace dishes to Howard. Deflects the pass. Gasol. He feeds it to Kobe. Six to shoot. And he's knocked off course by the D. The foul call. He'll shoot free throw. You know, I heard an interview with Kobe. They asked him when he knew he was special at basketball. And he said he scored 60 points in a game back when he was six years old. 60. The free throw drops for Kobe. And Steve Kobe obsessive about the game at a young age. Even, you know, even at six years of age, he was already focused on developing his left hand. You know, his dad played in the NBA for such a long time, guided him along, grew up basically in Italy where his dad was coaching pro basketball. Clark, he was exposed to so much, but obviously from a very early age, he was very focused. Well, Joe Jellybean Brian, his dad, who played a long time in the NBA, nine plus years, and another seven in Europe or so. So he's been around the game and has grown up in what has been the family business for Kobe. Felton kicks to Anthony. Outside kid. Here's the three. <laughs> Chandler outside. Fades back. And no good trying to get that one. At the end of one, a closely contested game so far. Two Lakers ahead, up two. Live from the Staples Center, you're watching 2K Sports. It's a special New Year's Eve NBA And we're ready to get rolling once again here for our Christmas Day matchup. And taking a look at the Lakers' performance here, Clark and Steve, what have they been doing or not doing in the game? And they've done a nice job here offensively to establish a rhythm and a pace to this game. And I like that they're finding ways to score. Playing well here, Steve. Here are the five New York has to start here in the second. J.R. Smith out there with Felton. Then there's Wallace. Then there's Steve Novak. And it's Anthony in at the power forward position. Well, it was the Los Angeles Lakers winning their last game against Golden State. And winning that game the way they did, guys, with the incredible fourth quarter comeback. Couldn't have been a better feeling. Yeah, it was definitely a gut check win for them. They never stopped fighting, which was really impressive, even when things looked their worst. The Knicks shooting their first free throws. First trip to the line in this one. Well, they're doing okay as the season goes on. They're shooting about 76% as a team. And comparing to the numbers of last season, They've made a bit of improvement, so that's some positive momentum they can look to build on. Looking at who's out there now for the Lakers. Jordan Hill, he's checked in for Howard. Saul comes in for Antoine Jameson. Kobe's checked in for Meeks. And it's Duhon in for Darius Morris. Gets it to go. And that's now six points for Kobe Bryant. And it's his poise at the offensive end that impresses me most. This guy is unflappable. Outside for Felton. Right side, Felton. Second chance shot. Rebound by Meta World Peace. Well, you know what? You really expect him to knock that jumper down when he gets a good look like that. And out of bounds as the Knicks team possession. I tell you what, that's just a major unforced error right there, guys. My goodness. 
and the first half ends in a close one. Lakers lead by two. And coming up after the break, it'll be Damon Bruce breaking down all the highlights from the first half of play. And now, brought to you by Sprint. I hope everybody got what they wanted for Christmas morning. Here's one present from me to you, all wrapped up in a halftime report. At Staples Center, the Lakers in a close one against New York. They're actually looking to push their current winning streak to five. Defense, a cornerstone of everything this coach does. They've tightened down the screws. They're in total control. A good start for Kobe. No big numbers by his name in the box score, but he's doing the little things out there to try and get his team the win. And battling nonstop, the New York Knicks. They're really going hard at it on the boards, offensively chasing down every mid. And now the start of the second half. Neither side jumping out ahead to the first two quarters. Kobe Bryant really making a difference here. Yeah, and this is exactly what we've come to expect from this guy, and he has delivered here through three quarters. Yeah, that's not easy since teams always are keying on him as the team's top player, but to be able to play like he has with the reputation he's got, I mean, that takes an awful lot of talent and focus. And now let's check out the lineups courtesy of Gatorade all fueled up and ready to go for the second half of basketball. So the Lakers five right now. Kobe and Matt of the wings with the big pow Gasol at the four. Howard is out there with Duhan. For the New York Knicks, they won their last contest against the Minnesota Timberwolves. And what they did well in that game, Kevin, was attack the rim. They got to the free throw line and they converted once they got there. Yeah, it was hard-nosed basketball and fundamental basketball at the same time. Physical and aggressive, that's a recipe for success. Here's what the Lakers are going with right now. Antoine Jameson's checked in for world peace. Jody Meeks comes in for Kobe. And Darius Morris subs in for Chris Duhon. Anthony drives in, shoots from 12, cannot hit. Feeds it to Smith. The three, drives yet again. Good. He was not to be denied that time, guys. Fought his way to the glass and came up with the points. Here's Morris. No good trying to beat the buzzer. Tie game in Los Angeles. And we're just moments away from the start of the fourth quarter. Stay with us. It's a special New Year's Eve NBA celebration. Welcome back. It's time for the fourth quarter and time to check in with the fourth member of our team, Doris Burke, to find out who had the Sprite uncontainable game. Doris? Yes, guys. Kobe Bryant has had an uncontainable game tonight. He is this team's engine, and this game has been no different as he's been dishing assists out all game. We'll see if he can keep the motor humming here in the fourth, guys. Thank you, Doris. But, Clark, we've come to expect these kinds of efforts from him now, haven't we? He simply knows how to seize the day, partner. And that's what he's done in this one, guys. I mean, it's exactly what this club needed. On the court for the Knicks, Jason Kidd and J.R. Smith man in the backcourt. Up front, it's Carmelo Anthony and Tyson Chandler. And it's Novak in at the three, the small forward. Drops that. Bryant. Nails it. Kobe has been sensational. Kid with it. Outside Anthony. We've got 28 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys are not going to be in any rush on this possession. Not with the lead. I mean, now's the time to use the clock to your advantage. Take your time. Milk the clock a little bit. It falls. What a clutch shot there. Really, the definition of clutch. For three, Smith. Count it. And that shot brings them to within just one. A big bucket there to quiet this crowd, Clark. You know, that's exactly what you got to do. Take them out of the equation. Make those fans be quiet. Yep, and that's exactly what he did. Neither team having any trouble putting the ball in the basket. Nope, not out. I mean, we haven't seen much defense either. I mean, both of these teams really locked in to try and outscore each other. 
Oh, my goodness. That one got them going. Did it ever. They're on cloud nine. What an atmosphere in here. This is incredible. And so it's the Lakers who come out on top here. Well, they don't get much more exciting than that, Clark. They sure don't. And when it was gut check time, this team kept their composure, kept their emotions in check, and got it done. And that about wraps it up for Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Burke. This is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. And now, Jordan presents our player of the game, Kobe Bryant.